it's it just it's a little much. So there you go. Uh, can I blend it down? Uh, I could. I'll be honest with you. I'm tired of trying. <laughs> I really am. This is a lot of work. This will probably not be my purse one. And I'll just have to carry a um, little pack of, what do you call them, brushes with me. Because that was way too hard. Where's my blending brush? <laughs> I'm cheating. Yeah, that was just, it was way too hard. I think the colors are good. Um, again, I would not do your brow in this color. I think it's just too purple. I think it's coming across purple. Unfortunately, I'm going to be going to my Bible study with it looking like this. Because I don't have time to fix it. <laughs> um, actually, I am. I'm going to use this little brush. This little ma um, mascara brush. This is where you can come through goops. But you can also use this for your brow. And the more you kind of comb it through, the more it kind of dissipates the color a little bit. And I need to do that. It's just too purple -dy. too much. And also using the back part of my hand to get this one and kind of blend that out. And once again, oh, one of you said something about why did I put my concealer? I need to answer you back, but why did I put my concealer on last? Sometimes I don't put my concealer on because I'm not sure if I'm going to use it, to be honest with you. Uh, I don't like using concealer as you get older, especially with this stuff on. I feel like it's just too much uh, product on. And what that does is it sets the wrinkle. It doesn't help the wrinkle. So I'm just going to use a little bit of this Match Perfection by Rimmel and Color Fair Light, which is 230. And I'm going to barely put any on. And I'm going to stay low. I think the one she questions was when uh, my finger hit the, um, the rim of my eye and that It Cosmetics, because <laughs> it's so pigmented, just went everywhere. That's as much as I'm going to do. There we go. Yeah, that's all I'm going to do. Um, I need some lips. So we're going to use this bright lip color. <laughs> uh, that smells so good. Chanel makeup. I love it. Um, this is col uh, color Central Rose by the uh, Chanel Lip Intense. Again, this is on to watch. It lasts for hours. So just make sure you got it or you want it. Because it's going to be there. Wow, I have a really bright looking face, y'all. <laughs> this is all the good about the study. <laughs> I don't have anything planned. And this looks very dressy. They'll be like, well, that. You look very, have you been doing makeup videos? They'll be like, yes. Oh. I love this It Cosmetics eyeliner. Look how I'm not even having to pull the flap down. I'm just using the. Look how that just glided on without me pulling it down and, you know best ever. There's nothing better for a liner. There really isn't. Okay. Oops, I didn't put on my liner. Well, I guess I better do my um, eyelashes first. Let's crimp them at least. Crimp them? Use my eyelash curler. Oh, did y'all hear that? That was a little baby velvet sign. She's kind of bored. <laughs> she hasn't got to play very much today. Her and Brie actually did play a lot this morning, so I don't know what's up. I don't know what's going on with Velvet. I don't know why you're doing that noise. There we go. Now, this is also the best eyelash curler just because it is, this is the Charlotte Tilbury one. It is more expensive. It is rose gold, so it's pretty, but I think it's really because it's a really wide band, and it's also a really long band, so it just gets the whole of your eye, all your eyelashes at one time. It's great. What do we do afterwards? Always wipe it off because you got eye boogies on there. 
even if you just cleaned your eyelashes, I mean your eyes, is still from the makeup you have on to the little wormies that like to take a ride on your eye. Okay, and I am going to go ahead and put on a bit of a liner. I'm going to use the other end of this TARDIS. And that is going to be the liner I use. Do you see how I'm almost laying it flat to get all the way down under the boo-boo? Because I'm starting to be in a hurry. This may not go all the way to me getting my mascara on, y'all. Yeah, didn't do a good job at all. Here. Using the tip to fill in. Both in the front and the back. That's how bad of a job I'm doing. <laughs> and doing little dashed edges. And I'm slumping. I was slumping so bad you can't even see. I'm sorry. Gosh, I just made two boo-boos. Well, I'm making a lot of boo-boos. Make it boo-boo time. Okay. And I'm going to use this um, L'Oreal Voluminous Lash Paradise. It's the waterproof, and I really love it, y'all. It's a really good... Uh, it's a spoolie brush. It's not a comb brush. And I just, I think it's a good volumizing. Volumizing means it's going to put down a lot of product. So if you don't like a lot of product, you won't like this. But that is what makes your eyes look voluminous, is it's, it thickens the lashes up by adding a lot of product to your lashes. You can't add lashes. Now you can make them grow faster. You can make them grow longer with certain um, hormones and treatments and things that people have out there. I won't even name names because y'all know there's a lot of them out there. They're expensive, but they work. As long as you're using them, they work. You can't stop using them because your eyelashes fall out all the time. That's what they do. They're designed to fall out. Probably because of those little worms on there. There'd be a buildup of worms if they didn't fall out. I know some of you are like, Beth, what worms are you talking about? There's worms that live on the... Um, base of your eyelash line and they're good worms they eat the bad bacteria that's what they're there for you can't see them they're microscopic you can't see them no matter how close you get you can't see them if you don't think i'm right uh there's a video actually out that talks about the all the bugs that live on the body and it, the, it's funny because at the beginning it shows a person just acting like they're going crazy itching because of the thought of that but they're the good bugs like the good bacteria you do want you know, like you give yourself probiotics, that's bacteria, but it's good bacteria. Help, keeps the gut healthy. You know, even after just one coat, that you almost don't need to do a second coat with this product. This is a very good product, y'all. Like literally right now, I don't really need a second coat, but I'm going to put it on. And I would even warn you that it, when you do the second coat, because the first one, since this is waterproof, has already begun to dry, be careful of clumping. So you want to have a, like one of those little plastic combs or a spoolie handy to get clumps out. Do y'all notice I haven't even had to go back into the mascara, uh, what do you call that, tube? That is actually not what they call it. It's not a bullet. What is that called? That's what they call lipstick bullet. What is the mascara? It's not case, y'all. What is it called? Not canon. It's... I can't think of the name of it. Yeah. So that's it. That's the look. It's quite made up looking for Bible study. And, and not that you can't be pretty for Bible study. It's just a little... It looks like I'm going out and I'm not. <laughs> I should have done this with my eyebrows done. And I'm fine. Okay, y'all, so that is the look. I hope y'all enjoyed it, and I don't know if I've run over or not. No, I have gone into two videos, but I haven't run over in the second video, so that is good. You got to see the whole look, and I will upload it, and, and now I need to go to my Bible study. I love you guys, and by the way, I'm hearing through the grapevine that YouTube is going to change 
who gets to stay on YouTube, like, you have to have, like, 4,000 minutes or something to be a YouTube partner. I don't know if that you, you have to be a YouTube partner to be on YouTube, but if that's true, y'all, I don't have that. So I don't guess, unless we have a sudden huge influx of people, it's not even the number of subscribers. It's how much time people stay on watching your videos, which might do take a long time. But, um, so that's going to be interesting. I don't know if that means I'm going to get thrown off YouTube. If I am, find me over Instagram. I'll do something. We're going to be in touch. So if you ever can't find me on YouTube, go to my Instagram and comment on one of my pictures. Yes. Okay, I love y'all. Bye. Bye, 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 bye. I'll be checking out on that YouTube stuff. I don't know. I'm going to have to read up on it. Love y'all. Bye.